The main source of power, which drives the bass drum pedal, is not. In pedal drive, or spring tension, or length of the footboard. The beater, rebounding off the drum, carries the main source of power. Let's put this to test. In this test, spring is completely removed. That leaves two power sources, the foot and the beater rebound. The foot sets the beater to motion. The beater, action force, strikes the drum and is instantly thrown backwards, reaction force. This force is sufficient enough to drive the motion. However, the foot must be clear off the footboard in order that Peter could rebound. This is where Brook Technology steps in. The foot is fully on footboard during the stroke. However, as soon as the beater strikes, the weight shifts to Brook. Beater rebounds freely. Brook Link, with the footboard, enables pull technology, where drummer actively controls the rebound while resting on Brook plate. It is fundamentally important that, following the stroke, foot stays clear off any part of the footboard in order that beater rebound could flow. Spring tension would tighten and speed up the motion, but power and consistency is primarily fueled by beater rebound. If you obstruct it, you would simply struggle and unnecessarily drain your muscles.